Yo, 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 it's your man from a fan's point of view. Why the hell would you call, why the, would you call your friend that return to the essence a servant? Why, why would you do that? Why, what, what, what's possessing you? Are you stupid? Like this is the, and this is the definition of clout. Clout. He called a man that he called a fiend, dope fiend Daryl. How you going, first of all, how do you feel comfortable saying R.I.P. and then calling him a dope fiend? Yo, and everybody be thinking I be bugging. I wasn't even going to comment or say nothing. Because I just really wanted my money. But I'm like, yo, only going to do some stuff. Fuck that nigga. You put out an allegation or you think that was wrong and cr you crossed the line and I'm suing you. But nevertheless, a person that you was close to died. And the first thing you called me was a dope fiend and said that was my servant. Nigga, who think you think you a motherfucking king? You really taking this Bible thing to your head? You really think you live in the eight in in, in, in the three thousand BC? A servant, nigga? What how, nigga? What land you got? You live in a duplex. How the fuck is anybody your servant? That nigga came and cleaned your nasty ass house because you lazy. He helped you. How dare you call him a dope fiend? Yes, he might have did some things. But that's God's job, not yours. He a dope fiend. That's my servant. What the fuck? I don't never want to die in your arms. I don't know what you're going to say to me. He told me that he had herpes before he, he died, y'all. Why would I want you on my team? Oh, man, where is Daryl family? The real family. This nigga ain't his family. This nigga's a clown and a sucker. You use that man. <clears throat> You just mad because he gone because you can't use him no more. God took a, God is taking everybody away from you because, listen, that's crazy. A man rather return to the essence than to help you because you a sucker. What you was paying him in crack? You said you was a dope man. You probably ate it in the better than him. Now you feel guilty? You was a sucker, nigga. He's a servant. And what the hell are you? If he's a servant, what the hell are you? God told us to be humble servants. The man is the servant of the house. So if he was a servant of the house, he was doing a better damn job than you. R.I.P. Daryl. Put some respect on that man's name. He was a clown. You did that for shop value. Daryl really gone. He was my servant. You disgust. Everything that come out your mouth is nasty. He was a dope fiend. What? Why do we want to hear about that when you're saying R.I.P. when somebody returned to the essence? Remember, remember he was in my blog, y'all. Remember he? Everybody's in your blogs. You a reality TV show? That's what you really want. This nigga's a clown. I don't want to die. Yet. I don't want to. Yo, listen. Before I return to the essence, God, please make sure Bad Truth is out my life. I don't want him saying nothing about me. Let that nigga go before me. Because the lies he gonna put on my name is disgusting. Bring back Daryl and take battle truth. Facts. Bring back Daryl and take truth. How you gonna call Daryl a servant? You a weirdo. A straight weirdo. Daryl a servant. What? That man just lost his life. The first thing you call him was a dope fiend and a servant. Shaking my head. Shaking my head. God, take truth and give us back Daryl. What did truth do to deserve to be here? He lied on me with allegations that's crazy. He had sex to get his studio. He had sex with his fake daughter. He lied and said God brought him here. His page got taken down by God. So we don't know what his second page is about because it ain't the power hour no more. So what is he here for? At least Daryl knew his um, worth. He was, he was cleaning up homes. You know, they actually got job for that. He the cleanup crew. He come clean up everything, make sure everything's spick and spin, he get paid for his duties. What is Battle Truth here for? Take truth and leave Daryl. RIP to Daryl and his family, condolences to y'all. That man was a king. He might have not died that way, but that's God's job to call. 
Let him deal with God. God said first is death, second is judgment. And I pray all of y'all give y'all life to Jesus Christ before y'all go. And please be in hands, good hands, not hands like battle troops, where he going to mock and um, deem you and make you look crazy out here in these streets behind your back. Like he got a right to. I can just imagine how the family feel. Huh? She a man from a fan's point of view. Don't comment.